Hello guys, Solitary Gamer here, and today I'll be reviewing Supposed Kid from Last Dungeon Boonies Moved to the Star Town. This wasn't a special great anime series, but it was a decent anime series during the season that it aired. In this anime series, the protagonist Lloyd sees as the weakest person in his village. He doesn't have much confidence in his fighting abilities at all. He still hopes to be a soldier one day, though. He is planning to leave his village and go to the kingdom of Azami in order to enroll in the military academy. What he doesn't realize is that his village is legendary and the people there are the strongest people in the world. Even if he's the weakest in his village, he's still many times stronger than everyone else in the world. This comedy anime series has the same problem as many other comedy anime series out there. It reused the same joke over and over to the point of the joke not being funny anymore. It was funny at first seeing Lloyd be overpowered and not realize his own strength, but it soon gets old and just makes Lloyd seem very dumb. I get that maybe he wouldn't realize at first, but to have him act so naive throughout the anime series is just so unrealistic. It seems like the writers make him act dumb on purpose, so the comedic parts will still work. It just seems so forced and so lazy. Another issue with semi series is that Lloyd being so overpowered makes every conflict feel so pointless. Throughout the anime series, there are demon lords and other powerful enemies that are a threat to the world. The characters act like it's a dangerous situation, and it could be the end of the world. But we all know this concern is just pointless. After all, Lloyd can just throw a couple punches and feed enemies easily. The anime tries to prevent the situation, by giving us reasons why Lloyd can't help out, but in the end, he helps out anyway. That's the problem with overpowered characters. They ruin tension in the show, and make the whole conflict feel meaningless. The characters struggle hard to fight against powerful enemies, and Lloyd just essentially defeats his enemies in a matter of moments. It makes the side characters feel useless. Just what's the point of seeing the fight? People will say it's for a comedy, but like I said earlier, that kind of comedy the main character not realizing his own strength will get old quickly. The fight scenes and the plot just didn't appeal to me. Even in most dangerous situations, Lloyd would win anyway. I'd like to send me more for the characters. I really like Celine. She was so dear dear towards Lloyd. She was obsessed with him. It was so entertaining seeing her already playing out their lives together and seeing her want to be his wife so badly. Marie was so loving towards Lloyd as well. Not so much in a romantic way. It was more like she cared for him deeply because he seemed very cute. I liked seeing how happy she got when she was around him. Rio was another girl that appeared like Lloyd as well, but just doesn't show it so openly. It was nice to act shy around him and want to spend time with him. Aoka was a good character as well. She really cared for Lloyd a lot and really supported him. Mayor Rutilfon was a teacher at the academy and it was interesting to watch because he portrayed himself as a cool and carefree teacher at first. But there's obviously more to his character that really intrigued you later on. Lloyd was kind of boring to watch as the main character. I can see how people can find it funny to watch for how naive and innocent he is. But it gets to the point of him looking very dumb and it was just frustrating to watch. The opening and ending song for the semi series were okay. The music for the semi series wasn't really that intense during fight scenes. The animation style and animation looked average. This anime was an alright show, but I just didn't find the jokes that I was going for funny to watch. I'm not over exaggerating when I say it kept reusing the same joke of Lloyd being naive about strength over and over. It was just too much and it was just not fun to watch. It was more interesting to watch because of the funny interactions Lloyd had with the female characters in the show. I'd give this anime series a 6 out of 10. So that's all we'll talk about for this video. Thank you for watching the video. Have a great day night to wherever you are, and please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video, and please comment if you found anything interesting in the video.